Today's episode of Tiny Kitchen is going to be me and a special guest. It wasn't the dog, it was me. Making focaccia bread. This is our first time, well my first time making it. You've made it before. I have, but it's been a long time so I don't really remember. But we are no bread experts. So we're gonna attempt it today for dinner and take you along the process and see how it turns out. First step is going to be to combine the flour and some room temperature water in a stand mixer. Yes. Let that kind of get into a dough-like texture and then we're gonna add in the yeast <coughs> mixture after that. Are Using our trusty test? scale. So do you wanna measure that out? Yes. So we're looking for 850 grams of bread flour. We're just going to pour until we reach the desired weight. So now we're gonna put this in our mixer. And here's two cups of water, we need two and a half. Yeah, there's two. Tiny Kitchen is an aura. It's a way of life. It's a way of life. It's not always a place, but it's a place in here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. How much yeast? Um, we need two and a quarter cup. Uh, two and a quarter teaspoon. How say. much sugar? Pinch of sugar. Yeah, just a pinch. Do you want to get the sugar out? Just a pinch. My hands are still wet, and it's really hard to open this. Okay. Perfect. It's gonna help dissolve the yeast mixture in there, if you can see that. And then this will help it get all bubbly. And what you're looking for in the, is for a nice bubbly active yeast, because that will make sure your bread can rise. Okay, so the yeast has got some bubbles yeah. now. Yeah. We're gonna mix it. salt which adds flavor and we're just going to keep mixing this until it gets an elastic -y texture which might be a while but at least we don't have to hand knead it three two one ratatouille <laughs> i think i was about to say spaghetti but then i was gonna, <laughs> it's that italian <laughs> that's italian. three two one oh close, close. three two one yes okay all right, we're, we're safe. We feel better. All right, here's an update on the bread. Still going strong. I'm honestly not completely sure what it's supposed to look like. There's a lot of weird little lumps. There's some clumps. I'm thinking we stop it and try to like break up the clumps. I agree. Okay. Let's see. You have this handy dandy scraper. scraper. Um, However, from the time I made focaccia before, this is fairly close is I this think, normal? to the consistency. Okay. And I think these clumps aren't real clumps of like dough. I think it's more just like... Is, are of, they flour clumps kind of, or is it dough No, clumps? it's dough clumps. Okay, I'm gonna coat the sides of this yes, with some with oil. oil. Three tablespoons of oil. This recipe uses a lot of oil. And then we're gonna do a transfer of dough into this bowl, um, which is where we want it to rise. Now we're gonna cover it, and we're gonna let this rise for two hours, or until it doubles in size. There it is. We're gonna need two tablespoons of olive oil on this pan. Also, I am on hold currently for Expedia, so hopefully they get to me sooner later, but it's not looking too good right now. It's already been an hour and seven minutes, so. 
Okay, so now that this is in here, I'm gonna use fingertips to rub all of our bottom and sides. Okay, smart. Oh, it's very, very sticky. It's what we it's want. It's very soft. Rotate baking sheet 90 degrees and fold it half like that. Okay, and then we cover it and let it relax. Okay, so we'll cover one side. And then we'll just do that. Yeah, do it like you would do it like a pizza dough where you're like kind of lifting and pulling yeah. evenly. Yeah. Yeah, it is. The bottom's kind of sticky. Yeah, it's not. Oh, yeah, that's a great thing. You know, it's not like mine. It's yeah. really like I'm just like stacking blocks or like other stuff like that. You need to get it. Yes. Yeah. So, it's it's kind of, it's, that hasn't well, helped with my stress trying to try to avoid tearing the hair. It's like interesting. So but, soft. Uh, you know, all the bosses and stuff have been saying that. Yeah. Yeah. But we're basically yeah. just going to let this sit for like an hour and then we're going to put the rosemary on there. Uh, it's, it's about the Bake it and then we'll be done. Yeah. Yeah. It looks like a lot, but it's not enough. It's not enough. You, yeah, you do your fingers too. Grandpa, if this lady comes back on, you're becoming cameraman, okay? Okay? Okay. <laughs> now we're gonna put some garlic and rosemary in. We've so, pre, we pre hemmed the sprigs. You could say. So yummy. That looks so good. It looks very pretty. I'm doing my best. Are you lady, can I have pickle? Yes. You guys were that. Those bubbles are what we wanted. You got them. I got a little chunk of garlic. It's perfect actually mix. good. Perfect, mm. perfect mix, mix of crunchy and also dense. And chewy. And flavorful. This is so good. Mm. Chef kiss. Chef kiss. Mike and Ellie, did you guys try? Oh, and, uh, so good. Mm. Delicious. Mm. Dip it in your sauce. Exactly. I'm gonna dip it in like a sauce. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So listen for the tangy. Mmm. That is so good. Dad, try the bread. Mm. Who made this? Mmm. Is it good? Mm. That is. Mmm. Magnific. Magnific. What? How do you say Magnifico. That? I don't know. Magnifico. I could be wrong. Okay. Taste the bread. I haven't yet. Oh, you have to now. Oh, okay. A little bit too much rosemary, but perfect texture. Please, she does not know what she's talking about. Rosemary is just not my fave. Mm. Well, that makes sense then. Okay, let's see who else. Grandma? Grandma, you need to taste the bread. I need to taste the bread? Yep. Do you want it? Okay. Got away. Come on. my seat.
Dad, stop. Mm. Do you like rosemary? Mm. Cameraman's having a seizure. Dad. <laughs> Very, very good. Yeah. Okay, good. Why is the fan Amazing. on? Amazing. Grandpa. Okay, we'll get his roof. We'll get his. Luke, try bite. Up the back. Yep. Mm. Sublime. Oh, okay, mom. Um, put this on camera. All right. Mmm. That was really good. Right? Okay, give grandma a bite. You want to take a bite of mine? No. <laughs> I got not sick, don't worry. Garlic. It was good. Oh, that's what I was looking for. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't know. It's, it's kind of like hiding. This is fabulous. It's half me, half Catherine. I can't take all the credit. As much well, as I want to, I can't. I think you could have three quarters because you offered me the size. True, actually. She didn't offer you anything. Very good. Thank you. Glad you like it. You, you did well. Akasha, done. Ready? I don't Mocha, know. brown. Three, two, one. 